Mario is facing an enemy that for the very first time he doesn't really think that he can defeat alone. It's something unusual for the Nintendo and especially Mario universe. You may have seen a tiny weird little character called Spony. This is a key character because he wears a visor and by way of this visor he created this huge mesh. The visor was a sort of prototype secret. This white rabbit gets and starts tasting it but the malfunction creates a huge uh, interdimensional uh, tear, a sort of uh, vortex which brings lots of stuff from the rabbit's world into the mushroom kingdom. Pony, he is a scary little thing in an unknown world. Whenever he feels in danger, he's able to uh, produce, you know, a ray of energy from his visor. And this energy uh, merges things. He takes one element from the Nintendo, you know, uh, universe, one white rabbit, he fuses them together and creates a powerful enemy. Bowser Jr. understands that the visor is uh, very powerful, so he wants to uh, enjoy the opportunity of using Spony for his evil plans. Due to the huge, you know, evil energy created by this visor, they get even peskier and more mischievous. So some of them get evil and try to bring even more chaos and mayhem into the Mushroom Kingdom. Uh, fighting against the heroes, uh, Mario and friends, and the good rabbits. Well, as good as, you know, a rabbit can be. Uh, in our game we have uh, a huge pantheon of uh, enemies. And uh, as for uh, all the other aspects, uh, from since the beginning we decided to have something completely new. Also for the visual, uh, the mood, the gameplay of uh, all the enemies. We started from the white rabbits and we decided to twist the, the, the rabbit with the, uh, everything all around uh, the enemies in the environment uh, to justify this kind of uh, transformation, this kind of uh, mutation. To get rid of the enemy rabbit in our game, basically you have to defeat them. In that way you are basically removing all the chaotic effect, the bug effect that is controlling them which is the reason why they are so hyperactive and uh, crazy. By doing so, you basically are freeing them. They go back to the pitch castle and they start to populate it. And the more rabbits you defeat, the more rabbits you save. The more is creating a second problem. And this problem is right in the sky. There is a huge patch of energy, which is amplifying every time the player keeps going on and freeing the words from uh, the enemy rabbits. There's a story uh, full of twists, full of surprises, red herrings, uh, enemies and uh, heroes. It's a story of the beginning of a beautiful friendship between the Mario friends and rabbits.